Hey everyone, it's the Risener. I'm back. I don't know how long I'll be back for because things have been hectic around these parts. Mainly just at school. But hopefully I can get back into the groove here. At least somewhat, but I can't guarantee anything. But I will be continuing Rise of the Clockwork Stallions. And hopefully I can get back to Aquaria. I know I've only got like two parts in. But that game was really good. I do plan on getting back to that. And, along with other news, I managed to restore and retrieve everything I lost from Majora's Mask from a while back. You know, I got like six episodes up, and I got the cover art and everything. Now, I can actually continue everything as planned. Hopefully, and I won't run any more issues. I hope y'all I hope y'all still enjoying uh, Kyle's healthy, because they're great, honestly. I'm mean, just having a lot of fun with that. And I plan on doing the same with mine. Just like I always do. <laughs> but I guess it's nice to take a break every once in a while, you know. But then again, I, didn't, I wasn't really on there for long. But I was up playing like mad. Anyways, let's get back into the game. Uh, this is Rust and Bl uh, sorry, Blood and Rust. The game on Game Jolt. And I believe it's on RPG Maker. I'm dying. I've always wanted to start a story by saying that. Sadly, it's true. Dying. Well, so is everyone else, bub! What? I've got cancer. It's too late to do anything about the other about it other than painfully prolonging my life with medicine and radiation therapy. That's true. That is depressing. I couldn't bring myself to believe it when I first got the diagnosis. I went out drinking the same night the doctor told me. I don't remember much from that night. I said I was in a fight. Probably lost it, judging by my face the next morning. It's blood. After a few weeks, it finally hit me. I can't accept this. I need to do something. Anything. I'm too young to die. I've tried everything science could offer, and some things that had nothing to do with science. The more I tried, the more I despaired. Nothing changed. I was still dying. I was desperate. I would try to bla I tried black magic, white magic, magic water, Indian black salve, voodoo curve, voodoo that. Ah. So there's a curse, voodoo cures, and a hundred other useless cures. The further I went down the ladder, the more I despaired. That's when I found a faint glimmer of hope. The tree of life, hidden away in the Garden of Eden. It was an old friend of mine who told me. Of course, I thought he was crazier than me at first. I can't say I've been very I can't say I've been a very true faithful believer of God or during any time of my life. Probably just the opposite, but when my friend told me about the Gardens of Eden, I just laughed at him. But a couple days later, after after another failed cure, I changed my mind and decided to hear him out. My friend was a priest and has been researching the Garden of Eden. The very same garden Adam and Eve are said to have lived in. According to my friend, it was quite possible to breach the gates of the garden. Reaching the gates of the garden, separating it from the outside world, find God who condemned mankind to a life on Earth. So where is this garden located? I asked, still not expecting any revelation to come from the question. That, my friend, is hard to pro properly explain, my friend said. Suffice it to say, it will not it will not as easy getting it will not be as easy getting there as it's taking taking uh, a taxi. It will take some preparations to get there. He said, at this point, I was willing to try anything, so I said, I will do whatever it takes, I will do whatever it takes. And indeed, it was not easy. It took several weeks of preparation, while he studied a Byzantine ritual. I gathered all the various items needed for said ritual. Finally, the day arrived. We were prepared to open the gates of Eden. Of course, had the church found out what my friend was going to do, he would have surely been excommunicated from it. But we had our minds set on performing their ritual. He, probably because of his curiosity and concern for me. I, because I simply refused to bow down and accept death, regardless of the cost. To be honest, I didn't really expect anything to happen, but something actually did. As for how the ritual was performed, let's just say that blood was spilt that day. 
other way. Much to my surprise, the ritual did work. The moment we finished the ritual, my eyesight went dark. While I say that it worked, I'm still not sure that it worked correctly. The place I found myself in when I woke up could, hap could hardly be considered a paradise, such as the Garden of Eden. It may have been a total opposite, a hellish nightmare. Either way, it's not as if I had much of a choice. I had to find the Tree of Life. And if it's not here, I'm already dead. Well, that's a morbid beginning. Let's see what we wake up in. It's got an interesting storyline so far, but then again, this is only like the first, what, three minutes of it? Yeah, I believe this is on RPG Maker. This is where I woke up after the ritual. I'm not sure this is the Garden of Eden after all. It doesn't look anything like the Garden of Eden. But then again, my friend said it could be a, that it could have changed. After all, it had been it had been thousands of years since anyone last saw it. But could it have changed that much? He didn't really say that. Either way, I might as well try not. I might as well try now that I'm already here. After all, this is the closest I've been to finding a solution to my problem. It's not as if I have much of a choice. Still, it's not a very pleasant place. Far from the paradise described in the Bible. Either way, this place sure makes me feel strange. Countless hours of lying on a bed, staring at a rusty ceiling can make anybody feel strange. But I don't, but I don't think that's quite it. I'm starting to feel claustrophobic in the small cramped room. I haven't talked to anyone in quite a while. That's the first thing that crept up on me. Now it's hunger. I'm going to go find myself something to eat. I have to, but I would rather want to die here, but I'm scared. I have no idea whatsoever of where I am. For all I know, it could be another dimension. Maybe it is. I doubt the sounds I've heard at night could possibly have made by any creature, any creature I know. The heaving, the incoherent screeching, and the strange sounds. I'm sure I've never heard them before anywhere else but here. I should probably stop thinking too much about it. I will not be able to muster up the courage to go outside. Today is the day. I told, mus I told myself yesterday. Then I must go outside. Tomorrow, I might not have the strength to do so. I will go now and find something to eat. Oh, what? My hunger at the top left. I should make sure I'm back in my room before night falls. I don't want to find out what made sounds at your night. Night falls at 2100. Oh, yeah. Moving around will increase your hunger. If your hunger rises too much, you'll get weaker and won't be able to run. If it rises to the max, you'll be dead, so be careful to keep your hunger in check by eating. Holy crap. Okay, this is interesting. Two square inventions. Keys, obviously. Reminds me of Silent Hill. Heavily of Silent Hill. Uh, I need to be conservative of my movements. Can I even run? I'm gonna run. Shift. Okay. I wanna waste that. That blood. No, it's a wall of what? It's a wall of, like, vines or something. What's this? Found side cutter. What? Oh. What? Wait, hold on. Hold on. Can I access? Oh, don't do that. Items. Okay, X. Got it. Okay, cool. <coughs> Refrigerator. Excellent. Meat. Mushroom soup. Pavidon and mystery meat. Fridges can be found in various locations. They'll be they will be refilled after sleeping. Excellent. Please tell me those are the fans. Meat and garlic. And a one. Locked. Let's go back. Okay. Um. Down. All right. <gasps> what? What? Uh. What? I saw you. What the? Poor. Okay, what? Uh, oh dear. Okay. Fear levels rising. 
That train. The back door is locked. Let's eat something. That only gave me 50. What is that? Woo! Alright, cool. I love them for just... That's going to be my friend. My only friend. That was whole LP, I swear. There's an elevator right there. And nowhere. What the hell is down there? Gate key. Perfect. Okay. Seriously, what's down there? Some kind of grounder? Sorrel kit and Sorrel recipes. Excellent! Alright, cool. I'm going pretty far. What? What? Oh! Oh god! I wasn't even paying attention to the freaking. <gasps> and save. No! Oh, no! Oh, God! Oh, hold on, guys. I'll, I'll resume it once I get back to the part. I'm so sorry. I forgot to save. <laughs> oh. Alright. I'm going to save halfway through this, that's for sure. <clears throat> okay, did I go down here? I can't. Okay, yeah, I can't go down there yet. That's where the gate key is. Okay, that's where the gate is. Alright, so I gotta keep an eye on the time. I lost complete. Okay, I lost complete track of that, and I cannot do that again. Let's go ahead and grab the gate cutters here. The side cutters, sorry. Oh, now you turn on little. Okay. Where's. Oh, you dick. Right. Items. Got it. Okay. Right, come on. Okay, there you go. Nom nom nom. Okay. Let's go off to the right here. Get this. And, uh, okay, yeah, that's right. I don't know what's in there, but I can't go in there yet. Uh, it's saved now. Wait. Wait. Oh, I get it. You saved. <gasps> oh, god dang it. That keeps scaring me. <laughs> so, boy, I saw you, you little bastard. God. Uh, okay. Let's go to that fridge. I'm not gonna come back. Well, I'm, I'm gonna come back as soon as I get that key. But can I make it? I'm not sure if I can make it. Can I make it? No, I can make it. Oh, I can't make it? What? Okay, I can't go over there yet. Let's go back. Gotta get back. Oh, my God. Long. I do not have long. Do not have long. <sighs> okay, come on, come on, come on. I'm, I'm gonna make it for sure. It is a bit tense, though. <sighs> okay. Let's go ahead and chill up here. What's this? Save. Ah, oh, it's a save button. Okay. Cool. Oh, oh, gotta eat, gotta eat. Oh, man. Gotta eat that crap. Needs to be cooked. I need the survival kit. <coughs> Can't eat that. Oh, no, no, no. Add slightly to hunger. I can live with that. Alright. Perfect. Let's hit on out. Gotta watch my hunger, but I think I, I think I can do this. Let's grab more food. Excellent! Okay. Survival kit should be down this path. Or something of that. Right, it's 801. I went up there, so down here? I don't know. Balls. Why don't I keep forgetting these things? Right. 
Okay, let's eat again. It'll last me for a bit. I want to save this cooking me as much as possible until I get the survival kit, then I can... Oh, you little dick. Oh, don't play games like that, you little douche wagon. <sighs> Train. The back door is locked. Oh, no. What is that green orb? Parasite killer. I hope that comes in handy. Oh, right, that's why I couldn't get across. Oh. I'm stupid. Okay, survival kit's on the left here. We've got this key. <laughs> Can I walk into that? Okay, good, no. Okay. Items. Ooh. Uh, let's see, mushroom sh- Hey, there we go. Yeah, um, sit up. I know this. Items. Gate key. Nope. Wait, side cutter? Yeah, I didn't work out as planned. I didn't think so. Let's go to that gate. Ooh, wait, it's getting pretty close. I don't like that. I do not like that. Uh, let's go inside already. Awesome! Okay, cool. Uh, nope, back, back, back. Okay. You must have a recipe book for gra they begin gra crafting. Once you have a recipe book, you can start crafting. Duh! <laughs> when the recipe book is selected, all possible items in the recipe book will be listed, and you will ha you'll be able to craft them, provided that you have the necessary ingredients. Excellent. Ice. Ah, yeah. Parasite killer. Meat. Okay. Ooh! Luck soup. Nice. Items. A good meal. I hate garlic. Ah, oh. uh, let's eat mushroom soup and then what? Okay, I'm gonna give it one more day. <laughs> okay, and I'm gonna open this gate here. Yes, excellent. All right. What? Maybe there isn't a reason down there. Maybe there isn't. Okay, what? I can barely even move now, unless we're sneaking or something. My movement's very limited. Uh, I don't think I want to linger here much longer. What the piss is this? This is... This is ridiculous. Holy crap. What's that? What's that? Okay, I'm gonna grab this and go up because I don't have long. 810 key! Oh god! What the heck? Oh my god. Oh my god. I don't have long. Oh god. What are those? Why? Why? Oh god. No thank you, no thank you, no thank you, no thank you, no thank you. Okay, okay, I can make it. I can make it. I can make it. I can make it. No, 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 no. 
No, 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 Lack of saving and throwing out and some crap like that. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed my comeback there. <laughs> and I'll uh, see you guys soon. Bye. You gonna me? That was my way. Ow! What the fuck? Damn it. What the hell was your problem? <laughs>